to all whom these presents shall come, greetings. Whereas, just like those who came before us, it is our duty to protect the children of the city of Fort Smith and the River Valley and maintain communities in which they all can be given the opportunity to succeed. And whereas, we must all work earnestly to create courageous and supportive environments that acknowledge the traumatic past, promote the healing of the wounds created by racial, ethnic, and religious bias, and to build an equitable and just society that all children can thrive. And whereas children have the right to every opportunity to learn, grow, and thrive in nurturing environments that do not violate their safety, their dignity, and humanity. And whereas every single person has the opportunity to exhibit an act of kindness to make a simple change within themselves that can have a profound effect on an entire society. And whereas if we all dedicate ourselves to the principles of truth, racial healing, and transformation, we can bring about the necessary changes in thinking and behavior that will propel Fort Smith and the River Valley forward as a united force where racial biases will become a thing of the past. And whereas racial healing is a vital and crucial commitment to the education, social, mental, and overall well-being of all of the residents of the city of Fort Smith and the River Valley, particularly our children. And whereas the city of Fort Smith, in conjunction with others throughout the state of Arkansas and the United States of America, as the National Day of Racial Healing in the city of Fort Smith, Arkansas. We urge all residents to promote truth, racial healing, transformation in ways that are best suited for them as individuals as a means to working together to ensure the best quality of life for our children. Now, therefore, I, George B. McGill, Mayor of the City of Fort Smith, Arkansas, do hereby proclaim National Day of Racial Healing in the City of Fort Smith, Arkansas.